and agents add they will not openly investigate the murder until they get jurisdiction in the case. Al Sunshine, Channel 4 News. Reputed Mafia associate Giulio Greco is scheduled to appear before Dade State Attorney's investigators here tomorrow in their probe of the gangland-style slaying of mobster John Rosselli. Greco was questioned last week, and it's speculated that he, like most of the other witnesses, refused to answer questions about the slaying. Most of the witnesses have organized crime backgrounds, in line with the current theory that Rosselli was killed by the mob for talking too much. But the 71-year-old Rosselli had many strange ties, aside from those to American organized crime, ties that have interested a number of investigating agencies, the CIA, the FBI, the Secret Service, and the organized crime bureaus of a number of cities all have conducted some sort of probe into the Rosselli affair. But because of the strange nature of the case, information has not been freely exchanged, bogging down the investigation. Rosselli's connection with Cuba was deep and long-running. In the years before Castro's rise to power, American gamblers ran the casinos for then-Cuban President Batista, and high among them were Johnny Rosselli and his underworld associates, Sam John Cana, shot to death last year, and Santos Traficante, now living in Miami. 